What's up guys? Welcome back. Nick up here at Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee. And today's test drive is 1965 Ford Mustang. We're going to be dropping the top. Before we do that, we'll look at it. It's got a 289 power steer, power brakes. Pretty clean. Check out the detailed pictures at maplemotors.com. We have financing and shipping on all the rides here. And of course, I do this every day and it helps me out if you hit subscribe and share this video. Towards the end, I'll be picking out the flaws, chips, scratches, whatever I can find. So stick around until then. Looking at the top right now, it's in pretty good shape. Looks a little, it's kind of rough in the middle. Soft here, I don't know what's up with it. You can actually see a little bit of a different texture there. It's almost like there's overspray in the middle. The back window looks great. Looking around on the inside of this top. Oh, there's a patch there. Look at that. Okay, guys. So we're going to get this dropped down. Sit back, relax. It's about that time. Let's go for a ride. Before we leave, we're going to look around the interior and check everything out. You got a lot of receipts over here in the passenger seat. You even got old pictures. I guess that's what the car looked like before it was redone. Pretty sweet. It's nice having all the uh, old evidence. Lots of receipts. I mean, you can tell they didn't really skimp. We'll be putting the top down. Let's do it now. Might as well. Might as well. Does the top work? Sure does. Coming down fast, too. Got her down. Now let's start it up. This is the first time that I've driven it. I moved it out of the parking spot behind me. Showing 7,120 miles. Hard to stand behind actual mileage in a 65 model. I mean, think about how many years this car has been around. All the gauges look like they are working. We'll give it time on the temp gauge. Turn signals popping up on the dash on the left. Also on the right there. Tax working. Clock. Anything? Nope, not. Place your bets, do you think the horn works? We'll try the radio. Try not to blast my head off here. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, there we go. Blower motor. It is blowing. Wipers. They are wiping. Wipers are wiping. A little dust behind that visor there. Have to tell the detail guy. He missed a spot. Panels look good. Hey, a cover for the top. We'll put that on. Why not? Throw down the windows. We'll go ahead and try that horn first. You ready? Hey, a horn works. Works pretty good. Windows. Not too bad on that side. Coming up with this boot. I'm not gonna bore y'all with all this buttoning, but I will get it on before we leave. Let's try the other window. And of course, to get a good shot, let's look at it real quick. And now I'm gonna roll up the passenger window, stick y'all to it and take off down the road. Looking good. All right, be right back guys. Let's get this buttoned up, stick you to the window. I'll see you in a minute. Here we go guys, getting ready to take off. We're gonna go on up the road. I don't think we're gonna have to stop at the gas station. Let's see if I can tighten this up. I think it's all twisted. Take the slack out of it, much better. Reverse, seems to work pretty good. Drive, we're about to find out. Anything I see, you'll know about it. We're stopping. Engine temperature did come up, so that is working.
looks like we have an opening in the traffic, so take advantage of that. A little bit of a little bit of a hesitation when we went to take off there, but as you can see, it's straight as an arrow down the road. Pretty smooth when you steer. I mean, it's it's instant, so there's no slack. The speedometer is coming up on the dash. How about the kick down? Kick. Did you hear that? Now we're in this parking lot. I'm going to be doing picking out the flaws. If you've been watching the videos, you know what that means. I'm going to go in here, pick out chips, scratches, rust, all that kind of stuff, and put it at the end of the video. Before we do that, undercarriage shots, outside shots, maybe a ghost ride. I don't know. I'll see y'all here in a moment. Okay, got you on the head cam here. Y'all look pretty good. I can see you on my phone here. And you're nice and straight. So, we'll go ahead and head out of here. Here's reverse for you. And we'll put her in drive. Suspension on this one feels good too. It's taking the dips in the parking lot well. I think we got a clear run here.
not hearing very many shakes, rattles, or rolls. It's just kind of quiet going down the road. Everything seems to be tight on this car. Very responsive. Feels how it should be. Nice little dip in the road here. Hardly notice it. And I'm right around the corner from the car lot now. Go ahead, get turned over here. Again, guys, make sure you go to maplemotors.com for financing and shipping, detailed pictures. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit subscribe and share. I'll see you in the next one. Later. All right, here to pick out the flaws. Let's do it. So it looks like on the front bumper here, it's in good shape. It is a little older. You can see some light scratches, some scuffs. But it's in pretty good shape. So. Little spot there. Chip, sorry for my shadow. I'm coming in at an angle so that I don't have that in the video. That could be cleaned up on the grill. Looks pretty good. A little bit of pitting on this one. Coming down this side. A little chip there. Bottom of the door has got a few chips here. Little crack there. Scratch right here. Been over. Like a little chip, a little scuff. Paint run in the back here. Back to your midsection. Chip here. Few little spots up here on the edge of the door. The handle there is nice and clean on the chrome. Chip in the middle of the door there. Little touch up mark. Some more touch up marks here in the middle. Looks like somebody's touched up this area here at one point. Spots around the headlight, back over the top of the fender, chips, see some touch up marks there, A little chip there, front windshield on this one looks pretty good. You got a crack right here though, a little star. This side, pretty clean. Chrome's nice and clean. Window there looks good, trim looks good. Your boot on the back here, it's got a little rip. A little scuff in the back here. Chrome looks good on that back bumper. Down your tail pipes. Down in your trunk jam.
chip there. Open this up. It's in good shape up under the mat. Clean and solid. Package tray there. Looks good. Jams over here look good. Seal around the trunk lid is in good shape. Coming on down with it. It's glue or something there, that's coming off. A lot of this little blotchiness will come off. It's like dirt or something will stain the paint. Chip right here on the edge. Scuffs in the back corner here. Up top. A lot of little specks, some overspray is what that is, and that will come off, fall in the paint there. It's like black overspray. Chip at the bottom here. Get some wax there. Stains in the paint. A spot here. Back to midsection. A little scuff there by the emblem. Up front here. A spot here. Scuff there. Some chips on the edge of the door. Chips up top. Touch up mark. Door handle's in good shape. Chrome mirror looks good. Vent window looks good. A little bit of pitting. Spot there. Another windshield wiper. Looking over the front windshield. It's in good shape. Seal around it. Not bad. All right, made it around the ride. Let's check out the inside. Door panel on this one's in great shape. A little thin there and there on the paint. Seal looks good. jam not too bad the seat on this one's got a few scratches in the middle there but it looks fairly good overall love the horses in the back interior on this one looks great See it's hanging up there.
motor is nice and quiet up under the hood. Chips on the edge there. All right, guys, we've been around this ride. I do appreciate you watching. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. That helps me out. MapleMotors.com has financing and shipping available. And of course, every Monday we come out with new rides. Again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Later, guys.